like super tired right now. It's week 39 in one day. Baby's still inside right here. Ah, yeah, we're going for fetal ultrasound today and check out her size again. I feel like she's gone down. So I think my fluid has been down or something. I don't know. Yeah, let's see how it goes. Okay. So baby was 3.3 pounds? No, 3.3 3 kilograms. kilograms. Is that 7 pounds? Yes, around 7 pounds. And then, what else was there? Heartbeat is fine. Fluid is okay. Yeah. I was surprised at the 8 out of the 8 though. Really? Yeah, because I was like, she got smaller. Yeah. I feel like she got smaller. Why did she drop? She dropped, yes she did. Okay, and... <laughs> You farted inside. <laughs> <laughs> that was hilarious. I know. I, know. I was like looking at the screen and it was like, put. Like, <laughs> no, that wasn't put. It was <laughs> That was that was loud. <laughs> so she that face in the woman. Huh? <laughs> like fully heard it. <laughs> um, and then so then the OB did the whole like you know, put his finger in me. <laughs> The way got fingered. I got fingered and it hurt. But apparently that can that may induce the labor and uh, within 24 hours. So just in case, I do feel a little bit of a flow therefore we had this under padding here just in case my water breaks and it hurts. I mean, and then it smells. We don't want it to, what, what's that word? Violate my car. Violate your car. <laughs> We're gonna go shopping now. Are we really gonna go back and get the kit? Yeah, I'm gonna get it. And then we're gonna go back downtown and grab the collection kit for court blood because we forgot it this morning. What else are we gonna do? That's it? Yeah. Alright, we're at Von Mills going to shopping. There's nothing really that we have to shop for now, but I guess I could do some walking. And uh, it is 12.43 right now. My appointment this morning was around like 10-ish where he, you know, I think it was called a cervical rippling. Is that, so that's what he did to me. And uh, I don't know if it's me just walking right now. Or it's, I do feel a little bit of contraction, but not a whole lot. So I'll see how it goes throughout the day. I'm not gonna tell him, I'm not gonna tell Joe yet. If not, he's gonna be like freaking out. So I was doing the pump from 4.30, no, from 3.30 to like 4.30. And I did it on the right side first and then it was just like sore. So I just switched from like, I did five minutes and I was like, oh, maybe my nipples kind of dry, right? So I did like one side for five minutes and then I did the other side. The other side was, was a bit more comfortable for me. And then I continued, you know, switching five minutes every side and um, uh, I didn't feel any contractions at all. I didn't feel any contractions. And then the second or third time, third round, I got my colostrum coming out, right? So I got like two drops of it coming out. I'm like, mm, I don't know if I should waste it. So I did the other side again and like one last time just to balance it out. The, you know, I did each side twice. Or no, like twice or three times-ish. And I stopped. I don't think I should really be inducing labor now because I'm just giving up. I'm so disappointed because I didn't feel anything at all in terms of like contractions down there. So I guess I'll just wait for her Carly to come out whenever she feels like coming out. Yeah. So last night I was doing those uh, breast pump. So I did it for like an hour from 3.30 to 4.30, like I said before. And then I was like, I didn't feel anything, right? So, and then I got like two drops of colostrum coming out from both sides. And um, so I was like, ah, oh, this is not working. So I stopped. I was like, okay, yeah, I'm not gonna do it anymore. 
and then I started getting a little bit of like a bloody show like a, a tiny tiny hint of blood on my undie so I was like at nine o'clock hmm, maybe I'll try it again so I tried it again on one side and damn I don't get how people use the breast pump or breastfeed later on it hurts so my nipple was kind of sore when it was pumping and I was just at the minimal like minimal minimal And then this morning, since 8.20, I started feeling contractions. Like, I'm not sure if they were or not, because they were, like, kind of, like, minor-ish. And it's really irregular. Like, like first one was, like, 8-something. And then, until now, it's 12.30 now. It's starting to get a lot more painful. Joe had to do the deck, so he wasn't back until 4.30 a.m. and he was sleeping with me until 11.30. He left for work, told him once my contraction starts getting regular and it's like every 10 minutes, then I think it's time. Today is November 30th, so maybe tomorrow, who knows? December baby, I wouldn't mind a December baby, but who knows, I just want her out, but like, I'm just feeling a little bit more like, shit is getting real, like, really real, this baby's about to come out, and my life's gonna be different, like, I've been, I, the past three weeks, I've been like, oh, I wanna induce labor, oh. Judy. No, it's not. Let me count this one. But damn, it hurts. It's starting to hurt a lot more than before. And worst thing is, I don't know why my contractions are so long. Like, a minute. Or two. It still hurts, but it's not like before. <sighs> Maybe I'll still count it just in case. Or is it me who's more like nervous now, more anxious, therefore I'm just contracting myself? I feel like I'm screwing up my numbers here. I don't know exactly when are my contractions or when it's just pain. I don't I don't know how to explain. It's just pain going through down there. Like menstrual cramping. My sister said I should be walking. I don't feel like getting out of bed right now. First thing is, I don't even know if this is right. 
Or should I actually be going to the hospital right now? But she's still moving, so I think that's fine. I have Turtle with me. The 5:45 ish. That's when I went to the washroom, and um, it seems like my mucus plug has came out. I felt it, and then I was like, "Oh, maybe it's you know there, right?" It was down the toilet, but I can. I'm pretty sure that was the mucus plug. <sighs> now I have a pad there just in case water or whatever other discharge comes out. I can feel it. It's coming pretty soon. Pretty soon. Hey, honey. How you doing? Oh, She's loud. Um, uh, yeah, no, I am. Really? Yeah. Instead of making sounds. So what's happening now? Well, I'm going to want to sit here just in case it's wet. Oh, okay, fine. Yeah. So what's going on here now? Baby's coming out soon. So this is our second time coming here, right? Yes. When did we come here before? 10? 10.30. No, 10, we left at 10.30. We left at 10.30. Maybe... Came here around... Uh, 12.30. Nine. Yeah. All the way here, our water broke. That's so funny. Driving like oh. a redneck. No, water is just kind of. Yeah, pretty much we got to like, what's the exit? Or watch some. Mm -hmm. I think I smell it. I can't smell anything, my nose is clogged up. I'm smelling it right now. Yeah, you are just sitting in it. Oh. <laughs> Alright! I'm really not taking up the girl. Can you do it? Can you handle it? I can't. You're a strong girl. Alright, so I'm you can do it. May I have order? Just think president. Think, think positive. We will continue this when we're inside. Alright? Say bye! Fair Bear out! Yeah.